It appears the third time is the charm as this multi billion dollar redevelopment of the old Michael Reese hospital site gets underway. After years of delays and failed attempts, redevelopment is finally happening in Chicago's Bronzeville neighborhood. This morning, as some in the community looked on, city leaders and others officially launched the $3.8 billion Bronzeville Lakefront Development Project. It's an endeavor to repurpose land on the near south side where the former Michael Reese Hospital used to be into mixed-use development where people can live, shop, and work. I'm just really excited and, and, and happy that this project is finally breaking ground. GRIT is a group of local developers who bought the 48-acre city-owned site for seven Seven million square feet of commercial, retail, and residential properties, along with technology and research facilities. It's a vibrant, dynamic community. People come to different neighborhoods in Chicago because they want to be in that neighborhood. Phase one of the redevelopment looks to transform the area. Along with affordable and senior housing, there'll be construction of the Bronzeville Innovation Center, a 31st Street Park, and renovation of the Singer Pavilion, the only original building left from the old hospital. The project will make history, led by mostly black developers. With the, an eye toward equity and inclusion, and bringing around and bringing along with us members of the community. The project is expected to create around 10,000 new full-time jobs in the neighborhood and another 9,000 construction jobs, too. The city of Chicago threw in $60 million in infrastructure spending to help redevelop the area, concerning to some who want to community benefits agreement put in place. These big projects happen where city resources are being used, state resources, federal resources, and the community is not included. The project will be completed in phases and is set to be finished in 2035. Reporting from Chicago's Bronzeville neighborhood, Evelyn Holmes, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.